Prepare for one of the most explosive UFC cards of the year. As one of the greatest athletes in the sport, welterweight champion George St. Pierre puts his title on the line against 22-2 number one contender John Fitch. And wrestling powerhouse Brock Lesnar takes on the Texas crazy horse Heath Herring. Plus, two of the world's best lightweights as Kenny Ken Flo Florian battles Roger El Matador Huerta. The Ultimate Fighting Championship presents UFC 87 Seek and Destroy. Live Saturday, August 9th from Target Center in Minneapolis, Minnesota on DirecTV Pay-Per-View. John Fitch versus George St. Pierre. My first reaction was like, whoa, that's going to be a crazy fight. When you put two athletes together like me and GSP, there's nothing short of fireworks possible. This is the, the perfect stylistic matchup at 170 pounds. Every fight is different. Every opponent that I have bring a different problems. I truly believe I have the solution. Everybody knows what an amazing athlete and what an incredible fighter George St. Pierre is. Right now, he's the number one welterweight in the world. He's got excellent striking, unbelievable wrestling, great jujitsu, and he's got all these wins over top flight competition. He's big time hurt with the elbows. Oh, no. The type of guy who's going to give George St. Pierre trouble is the type of guy who's just as tough as him and just as well-rounded as him. And in my opinion, the most dangerous guy for George St. Pierre is John Fitch. This guy is an incredibly tough guy, well-rounded, and an amazing test for George St. Pierre. He's hungry, he's on the way up, he's the man right now. I have the heart of a champion and the desire to win. I think I'm a better overall fighter and better than he is in every single aspect of the game. I'm gonna have to take the fight to him. I can't sit back and let him use his athletic ability to win this fight. At the end of the fight, I'm gonna have my end race. I expect a five, five minute of war, nothing less. I will do everything in my power to make sure that my hand is raised at the end of this fight. There's one thing that this fight will not be as boring, I guarantee you that. One thing people learn from the Brock Lesnar fight when Brock Lesnar fought Frank Mir is Brock Lesnar is for real. That's that's a real animal. I think that a lot of the people when they when they see that he came from the WWE, you know, they think that he's some big Hollywood acrobat who, who, who isn't for real, which is the furthest thing from the truth. This guy is a psychotic competitor. about a guy being thrown into the fire. He goes from fighting the UFC former heavyweight champion and Frank Nier, and then what do they give him after that? The Texas Crazy Horse, Heath Herring, one of the wildest dudes in the heavyweight division. Herring looking to finish! He's a well-rounded fighter. I'm gonna have my hands full. Heath Herring has reinvigorated his career. Heath Herring coming into this fight is now much more dedicated than he ever has been before about his career. Watches his diet, has changed his physique. He's coming off a big win over Jack Conda. Big shot He's a very, very, very dangerous fight for Brock Lesnar. I'll be out there with my crazy hair, and he'll eat with his big head, and we'll go ahead. For me, it, it's to, to make a statement that I'm capable of holding my own in the octagon and winning. Prepare for one of the most explosive UFC cards of the year as one of the greatest athletes in the sport, welterweight champion George St. Pierre puts his title on the line against 22-2 number one contender John Fitch. And wrestling powerhouse Brock Lesnar takes on the Texas crazy horse Heath Herring. Plus two of the world's best lightweights as Kenny Ken Flo Florian battles Roger El Matador Huerta. The Ultimate Fighting Championship presents UFC 87 Seek and Destroy. Live Saturday, August 9th from Target Center in Minneapolis, Minnesota on DirecTV Pay-Per-View.